was uh, you had to find this other ship and destroy it with missiles. And you also have to find these other fighters and destroy them with missiles. Now you'll notice the missiles are in the lower right hand corner of the screen and pretty sure it said 20 but I don't know. You might have to go back and check. Uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. You know, just use your mouse buttons to fire and just use your mouse and your WASD to move your ship around. If you, you know, you pick which one you want to use. I use the mouse. Much more responsive. Now, you can see here, like, the Corvettes and stuff that are shooting at you. It's usually best just to dodge their fire. You know, I mean, you, you know, you could destroy the turrets and stuff on them, but just really wasting time if you think you're going to bring them down. And yes, if you do hit those asteroids and stuff, it does hurt quite a lot. I don't know if I actually hit any of them in either of these videos, but let's hope not. I wouldn't be a very good pilot if I did. The effects on this game look just amazing, I think, for its art style and it's kind of cartoony looking, but still looks good. Very smooth game, very responsive. Pew, 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 pew. Now here we have the other spaceship that I'm supposed to bring down. You can see it because it has the health bar and the little circle around it, I think. Yeah. <laughs> it's usually best if you use these asteroids and stuff for cover, but then again you also can't shoot, so you gotta pick and choose. that ship right there has about e seven or eight fighters that are just surrounding it so I just took all those out and didn't even worry about the other space spacecraft that I was supposed to destroy now you see there those with the special markers those are part of the objective you have to take those out with the missiles you can't do anything else oh no being shot at. But you see, really, the bonus bonus objectives, you're, you're going to get them no matter what. So, oh, there he comes. Now he's using the tactic of hide behind the asteroid. Oh no. Oh no. to finish him off. Oh. I guess that was my fraps messing up. Oh no! Oh well. Anyways, as we continue on. Uh oh, 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 yeah. And as you see here, I'm I'm just using my ship's uh, cannons just to take down his health a little bit before I waste my missiles on him. Like it says in the objectives, you have to use your missiles to take him down. There are those other fighters again. And even once you complete your objective, you still have time to you know get in and out. It says up there it has so many seconds next to the uh, mission. Uh, what would that be? Mission status? Text? Title? Mission title? Anyways. You can see here and just let you. And then hyperspace! And then on to the next one, which. What will it be? Ah, you have to destroy that space station that's in the background. 
here you see you have a little support a little support with you not very much they're not as effective as you but that's what you get for being with a bunch of computers and PCs Like I said before, you really just want to dodge the Corvette missiles. Take down the Republic scum. Now this, if you notice in the objectives, it says that you can use missiles, but unlike the other mission before this, you don't have to use your missiles on this. It's, uh, I like it better, but as you can see, I usually use my missiles right here on these shield generators because I want to. But you only have a limited supply of missiles. I assume you can increase that the higher level up you get and you know upgrade your ship more uh, I think on my ship right now I actually only have an armor upgrade that was given to me by completing a quest uh, as you've seen from the other videos that's on this one um, the other footage I should say then you can see that you get these commendations uh, I believe they're fleet commendations uh, you can use those to buy some armor, uh, ship upgrades, and some other stuff. The armor you get from it looks pretty silly, but that's my opinion. This is very fun, though. Very fun. Pew, 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 pew. You can hold down your uh, left mouse button for it to automatically fire or you could be like me and click it every time you want to fire because you can it's up to you personal preference now you'll notice that that antenna right there uh, 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 has a uh, has its little target around it but you can't really damage it so it's best if you just move on uh. Pew, pew, pew. Now those little satellite things right there, those little, I guess you would call them like a defense tower of some sort, sentry tower, maybe. Uh, just like the Corvette, you just want to dodge those because you really can't do anything to them. You can just shoot at them and, you know, do nothing. <laughs> we space, the final frontier. These are the voyages of the Sith Inquisitor and his companions. Anyways, back to Star Wars. Uh, now once you complete this mission, unfortunately you don't get to see the space station actually blow up and you know maybe fall to that planet below as much as we wish it would. At least I do. I think that'd be neat. There's another one of those sentry defense stations. As you can see, it doesn't really have any targets and stuff on it, so it's kind of pointless to shoot at it. Bah. Republic scum. Bah, bah. I'm Sith and I'm evil. <laughs> Look at me as I shoot at your space station. <laughs> <sighs> this is why I'm gonna play Jedi whenever the game actually comes out. <gasps> I'm gonna play a Jedi. <gasps> oh no. Even though I will miss this starship, I like it a lot. I like it better than the Defender or whatever its name is that you get. I'm the Jedi Consular. Oh well. Yeah, yeah. 
avocados. I'm shooting at them. Here comes my backup doing, you know, absolutely nothing. Just kind of flying around. Now I've had all my objectives done for a while, but like I said, it has that time thing. So that gives you time to stay alive, which I assume during higher level missions that might actually be pretty hard. So we'll see though. This is just uh, in this video, I think I'm level 17, maybe 18. Uh, 18 is the highest I got, so yeah, I assume it is 18. But, very fun, very fun. But, uh, looks like that's it. Oh, no. They want some more. They want some more of me. Well, I don't think they're gonna get any. Oh. But okay. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Oh, oh, oh.